put this on. Okay. We're good. Hello everyone, it's Maureen again. Welcome back to my channel. Da -da -da. What, what? Today I'm going to show you guys what I bought in the Philippines and in Japan. I know it's been two months already since we arrived from the Philippines. I didn't really have the time to film this. I was supposed to use this, but I didn't really want to use it. Not until I've shown you guys this stuff. So it's it's like uh like unboxing or something. This video is not like bragging. This stuff is not not really extravagant. Some of you might like and some might not. And so if you're not a fan of watching haul or a travel haul or anything concerning about hauls, then you can click the X up there. If you love hauls, then you can stay and watch this video. Without further ado, here is my travel haul. Okay, our first thing would be... Are you guys ready? Okay. This is... The dress is just a dress from Forever 21 and I haven't seen this one um, here in the US so I just thought about buying this in there and I thought it was like on sale that's why I bought it but then when I bought it it's not on sale. Love the cut on this one. If you can see the lace right here. The lace right here is really pretty. Look at that. And then right in here near the tummy you can see some like see-through and there's flowers and stuff I'm gonna try wear it and show you guys how it looks on me but it's super long and I need to like alter this so that it will fit me it would be so good for the summer so the other item that I bought in the Philippines is from this one I know every Filipino knows this kind of brand this is from Havaianas I know I know it's still winter here in Michigan I've lived in the Philippines for a long time my obsession buying a flip-flop when I'm in the Philippines especially when I'm on vacation I'm not using it here in Michigan for three seasons but I am so obsessed with flip-flops just so you know so if you're my friend and you're watching this right now or you're coming here visiting me then flip-flops is a good souvenir or a pasalubong and I'm gonna show you what's inside this they put it in this box I'm a size 8 and so here you know me I'm a pink girl everything is pink so I bought this bubblegum flip-flops which is super cute I'm gonna use this a lot in the summer and this is my first ever pink bubblegum uh, flip-flop and I love it so much and yeah I think I've shown you guys the video when we went to Havaianas or no, it's not Havaianas. It's like all flip-flops store and yeah, this is the one that I bought and I love it so much and I can't wait to wear it in the summer. Woohoo! Yeah, love. I tried looking for Havaianas in Macy's. I've seen ones but they don't have a variety just like in the Philippines. In the Philippines, they have a ton. There's slim ones, there's this ones, which I love, and there's the sandals. Like two years ago, before this vacation, I also bought a flip-flop. I just wanna show you guys what it is. It's this one, and it's just black, and it's not really a fun color, but it's basic. It's black, and there's gray, and you can wear it anywhere you want in the summer. Even if it gets dirty and stuff, it will still be okay. I think I bought this for 995 pesos. Now, we are going to jump 
on to the tech stuff which I'm so excited to show you guys because I know there's a lot of you that likes my tech haul which is the cases for my iPhone it's like 200 pesos each so it's like 10 or 11 bucks so the first one that I got is this one looks like a broken glass there <laughs> and it does protect here in the bottom and then in here also and in here so that's how it looks like and now I'm gonna show you how it looks like on the phone it's a gold color so I think it looks really good on my phone because my phone is gold <laughs> I know everyone hates whenever I say my phone is gold. I don't care what you say, but it is gold for me. Flat at the back. The inside feels kind of like a uh, bumpy. I don't know what you call this that sound. I don't know if my phone will be protected with this silicone case because it's really thin. It's gold color. It goes so well on my phone, so that's why I bought it. I am going to show you the second case that I bought, which this one. It's just a clear case and with a pink color on the sides. Yeah, just like that. It's just super clear, simple. My Apple logo is showing and the iPhone is showing right there. And that's how it looks like on the side. It's how it looks like in front and then the back next thing that I'm gonna show you guys is the pop sockets that I bought at SM Mega Mall in the Philippines I bought three of it they call it as an airbag cell phone bracket so cute I have the sunflower the strawberry one and the paw so we're gonna test this three to our phone. I know it's gonna be cute. So let's start with these ones. So this is the sunflower. I bought this for 99 pesos, which is kind of two bucks. Then, ta da! So we're gonna try this on our phone. Or maybe it would be nicer with a transparent case. Sunflower pop socket. See, yeah, it's so cute. Look at that. This is so cute. The next one would be the strawberry. Or maybe this is a silicone or rubber. We don't know. But we'll peel this off and put this in our case. And there you go. Pop socket, baby. Mmm. Love. And then we'll try the next one. I just rip it, guys. So I have to clean this with an alcohol. Try the next one, which is the paw. Like that. And then maybe with this one because it's like pink and gray looks really good ooh cute there you go so cute let me add another one in here um i think i just destroyed the um, strawberry. We'll just try this sunflower right in here. Woo! Yes! So cute! Super cute! Here you go! The paw with my glittery spec case. The last one that I want to show you is this one, the perfume. This is actually 
a gift from my husband. I bought this in Japan before flying to the Philippines. So I just found this perfume really good when I tried it. It just stuck in my skin and it's just, oh my god, the smell, it's so good. It's called Twilly Hermes or how do you pronounce? Twilly Hermes. We are going to unbox this all together. This is really fun. Unboxing it and oh my god, I just can't wait to smell it because it's been two months since I smelled this and here we go. Unboxing it. So the plastic is gone. And the Hermes Parfums in the bottom it says made in France. So that's the box. I know it's too bright, but let's do it. It looks like it's just a 30 ml or one fluid ounces. Can't wait to try it. Let's open. <gasps> it's so cute. So nothing in there. And here's the little tiny perfume. This looks so precious. Ah! Uh, if you don't know guys, I collect perfume. So this is my 11th or 12th perfume. I'm not sure. This is really cool right here. The ring around here, but I'm trying to take it off. But take the... <gasps> Look. This bow is super cute. Oh my god! Okay, let's spray it. Oh god, it smells so good. It smells so good! Okay, so yeah, there it is. The Twilly de Hermes. I finally unboxed this. <laughs> So that ends my travel haul. Oh no, I still have another one. <laughs> okay, so the last one that I bought is when we went to Japan. It's a clip, super cute clip, where I can use whenever I want my hair up. So I just love the flower detailing and uh, I bought this for 1100 yen there's orange and pink and some other colors right there it's so Japanese so finally we're done so that is all the stuff that I did buy when I was in the Philippines and in Japan they're not really expensive I enjoyed shopping and it's not that much anyway so this is the first haul in this channel so I hope you guys will like it and then yeah I think that's it I have enough iPhone cases here to show you guys so I think I'm gonna do a 2019 iPhone 10s or XS Max case collection so wait for that thank you guys for watching I hope you have a wonderful day and night and I'll see you in my next one bye Thank you.